you guys and gals, Brian. Buckley Woods, man. It's uh, May 13th, 2021. Long time no see. It's a beautiful spring day here in South Central Ohio. 63, sun's out. A few clouds. Haven't made a video in a while. Haven't been getting out much. All the fields haven't been turned over. It's a rough year for the farmers. All the rain we've gotten here in the past few weeks or month. So, yeah, I'm going to go out and give it a try on one of my sites. Been no till. A little bit of rain on it. So, hopefully, get on something cool. Just working a lot and running kids around a lot. You know, the normal day to day life thing. So, took a couple hours off early at work. Hopefully, get out here and get on some cool stuff. Seeing this, I did. Later. Yeah, I haven't found a whole lot yet. Been out here about half an hour or so, but looks like I got some sort of popped it with my stick. Looks like a little tool, maybe. Oh, some sort of little tool. A little work on it. That's it so far. All right, get back with you. Find anything else? Later. Yeah, that's kind of cool. I just popped this rock out with my stick, and then I looked down here and saw that. <laughs> that's pretty cool. Got a little bit of damage on it, but yeah, we'll take her. Not too shabby. All right, get back with you. Find anything else? Later. Yeah, go ahead and film this. Looks like it might have some potential. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe a little tool, maybe. No. Just a flake. Wah, wah. Later. Yeah, there we go. Finally. Long time coming. Got something here. It looks might like might be decent. See a couple of these stone pieces I found here. Get a hammer stone. Possibly. I got the butt end of a silt or a pestle, maybe. Bust it up. Let's pull this one out. This looks like it might have some potential. Yeah, not bad. Take it. That's the daymaker so far. Looks like it was wanting to be a bifurcate. Not too shabby. All right, get back with it. Find anything else. Later. Yeah, it's an interesting piece of slate. This looks like it's shaped. Maybe a crude slate silt, possibly. Some sort of tool, maybe. Yeah, we'll keep it. All right. Yeah, go ahead and film that. That's an awful round rock here. Probably hammer stone or. Look at that. Little hammer stone. All right, get back with it. Yeah, got something here worked on the ground. You got any more to it or not, but find out. Nope, broke. Broke tip. All right. Womp womp. Got something here It looks pretty good. Looks like a celt. I hope it's not a faker. Oh yeah. That ain't bad. Polishing a bit on that. Good shape. Heck yeah. Take that. Nice. All right. Good deal. A couple little nicks out of the bit. Just gives it character. All right, get back with you. Later. Yeah, I'm making my way back over to my stick. Got a nice little triangle. 
Madison laying on the ground, but it's got a little tip dang. Kind of sucks, but it would have been a real pretty one. Right there laying on that rock. Yep. A big old fire pop or something on the back, looks like. Tip dang. Real pretty material. Stripes in it. Bow to it. <laughs> All right. Yeah, if I find anything else, get back with you. Later. Kind of cool little piece. Figured I'd film it. Some sort of Madison, but it's got a little notch base. Pretty interesting. Huh. Maybe just some sort of tool. That notch base is kind of neat. All right. All right, do a wrap up of uh, the hunt today. Show you my stone pieces first. This was that butt end of a cell or a pestle. Got a divot right here. Pecked. Real old break that I suspect. Interesting. I got this. Brown rock, I'm gonna call it a hammer stone. It'll just be like some sort of fire rock or this little piece of slate. I don't know if they use it or not. Maybe like some sort of crude slate cell. Perhaps. Maybe just be a piece of slate. Looks like it's worked though. Hammer stone here, completely round, like a, a golf ball made out of granite. Pretty cool. And this piece of slate, I'm thinking it might have been a piece of a gorget, maybe. Sure does look polished to me and shaped. Green, gray banded slate. And probably my find of the day, this silt. Really nice. Got a couple little chips here in a bit. Decent polish on it. Not too, uh, not too big. Okay. Three inches, maybe. Not bad. And then for my flint finds, it's probably the point of the day. A little nick out of the base. And some sort of I forget perhaps. Not bad. And a lot of broken Madisons. Broke Madison. Broke Madison. I really like to have the tip on that one. Real pretty material. But Broke Madison. That was that one that's got the curve to it. Or dip dished out like a bow, I guess. Uh, this is pretty interesting. A little perforator. It's worked all the way around. Edge. Imagine that's what they were using it for. Some sort of little perforator. That was just a broke piece, but. Pretty neat. And then there's some broke pieces. Lots of broke pieces. 
Yeah, it was translucent. Oh, this little tool. Preform. I don't think it's just a tool. Oh, this was a little Madison or little tool. How's that notched base? Pretty cool. That would have been nice. It's a big old black tip. if that was used as a scraper or tool or not but I thought it was a cool piece of material real nice and quartz inclusion I don't really see any edge work on it though it might just be some sort of spa but it was a cool piece of material mm, what else we got in there looks about like that's it so all right till next time good luck out there everybody happy hunting later